Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the beehive. Oop, let's get some light on the subject. It's been a while, sorry, life happens. And yeah, let me see if I can put you here. So today is a solar eclipse day and I waited till the last minute. I don't have any glasses. So Blake and I are gonna go for a walk and we're gonna take and make some before we leave because I went online and it looks easy enough. So let's try it. I need to find a empty cereal box. Here we go. Let's see. This has been in here. Expires in 2022. I'm going to say we're safe enough to get rid of this. And throw it away. <laughs> Anyhow, it looks like the eclipse is actually starting. Just because of the way it looks like outside. I didn't realize how long it actually lasts. So in our area, I think it's supposed to last from like 1.45 to 4 o'clock. I got my box. I'm going to go get a piece of paper, white paper we're going to cut and put in the bottom there. Leave it down in the comments below. Did you guys watch the solar eclipse? I'm just going to eyeball it. And sorry, this video is probably going to seem crazy, but we're making it work. <laughs> gotta get crazy. Gotta get crazy. Gotta get crazy. But go get, um... Tape for me. Tape? Um, yeah. Any tape? Scotch tape with it? Yeah, just like regular. Uh, yeah, tape. It kind of looks like it's starting, Blake, if you look outside. See how it's starting to look just odd out? Kind of? I don't little... know. Maybe yeah. it's my brain. All right, so I'm basically cutting a white piece of paper. <gasps> Don't yeah, that's gonna lay across the bottom here. Blind. Blinded by the light. This, and then it said to take, put tape on it to secure it at the bottom of the box. And see, we can't really see if it's happening until we create this, Blake. And then we can see. We can look through here. All right, putting this down at the bottom. It says that reason why you do this is just makes the viewing a little bit clearer. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Okay. Here we go. It's in there. All right. Next thing we need to do is create a viewing area for our eyes and a reflection from the sun. And the way that we're going to do that is we are going to use aluminum foil and place it over the one side and then the other side will stay open which is what we will view through and once we do this we can see we can use this Blake and see if it's starting to cover oh. mm -hmm. um, so yeah we're just improvising and uh, you can tell like I'm kind of hurrying because we're gonna go to the park Take that, and days. yeah we're gonna go to the park and walk today and so I'm kind of hurrying so we don't miss it. We're not going to miss it. I mean, it, it occurs for quite some time. Oh, let me know if you're in like the viewing area for like totality. We're not. We are going to be about, actually, I looked it up. Like it said, ours is like 80, 85%. Dang. I know it shifts like it moves. All right, let me get aluminum. But this is what I did. All right, and then I'm going to cover this side. It doesn't matter which side. With aluminum. All right. And hey, we got heavy duty aluminum. Actually, I didn't realize it was going to be like this easy. Trying to keep yourself safe from aliens? I'm glad I didn't like burn up gas and run around. Yeah. Save, save yourself from aliens. And that, and we can show them what a beautiful park we have to walk in. Yeah, they're doing a great job on that Yeah, park. they really are. It's a nice little park. It's not far from our house. Okay. So I basically just, I'm going to tape that down now. So it doesn't move. Anyways, yeah, I would love to be part of a totality where it completely gets dark, Blake. Like, completely. That'd be so cool. I know. It'd be kind of scary. I know, right? It's just the thought of it. But today is supposed to be the end of the world anyway, so they say. They always say it's the end of the world. I know, the last one they said it was going to be, like, the end of the world. Oh, you know what I need? Can you go in my sewing box? I need a... A pin, like a pin hole. The sun's not due to explode for another 400 years, I think. Sorry? That's 
not very long. <laughs> Actually, hold on. I might have one in this drawer. All right, so I taped it up and it says on there you can experiment with the size of the pinhole. Look, I got this fake nail. Oh, guys, it went through my finger. <laughs> nice, my nail broke. All right, so now we're gonna puncture a little hole. Oh, ooh, that's big. That's what I have, okay. Let me see. All right, obviously I can't see anything inside because there's no light shining down through the hole. All right, let's go outside. Let's, <laughs> yeah, let's, let's walk outside and see how it works. Oh, it's gonna be bright. Trixie, you gonna go out? Guys, Trixie has not been doing very well. Her's getting old though. All right, so the sun needs to be behind us. All right, so the sun is behind us. I don't see anything, guys. Oh, wait, there it is. <gasps> okay, so cool. Okay, so you do have to like maneuver it around but, oh my gosh, let me see if I can get this to show up for you guys. Okay, you see the light? That is the sun reflecting on the white paper. Okay, and now I understand why it says that you can experiment with the pinhole, because literally the sun shines through that hole onto the white paper in the bottom of the box. And I guess as the sun gets covered, that is not as circular. Do you want me to show you how to look at it? Mm -hmm. All right. It's really cool, actually. And let me know what you think. Um, but what you're going to do is you're going to look down through here, put the sun behind you. The sun is going to um, shine through that light, but walk on the back deck. I'll show you. Oh, so only look through the one hole. Mm, well, it doesn't. You, can, you can't see it through the other hole. The sun's going to go through the one. Right. No, Trixie. So then I look no, wrong. you're already doing it wrong. What I did? Put the sun behind you. Sun behind Look you. at me. Okay, now look down in the box. All right. Now move it around till you see the dot. Do you see the sun dot yet? Yeah. Now see how you can move the box around and oh. move it? Now get it to where it's on the white paper. It's on the paper. And see how it's real circular right now? It's actually more oval shaped. Maybe it's starting. It might be starting. So, that's, that's so clever, actually. It is kind of clever, right? So, yeah, basically the light is just going down through the hole, and you're seeing the reflection of it on the white paper. Oh. Huh. Kind of cool, right? That's such a clever thing. So, when it's like 80-some percent, we should be able to look at this and only see, like, part of the sun. But, I don't know. What do you think? Should we make the hole bigger or keep it like it is? Honestly, I think it's fine. Okay. I think it's perfectly fine how it is. All right, well... Imagine right. getting, like, a huge box I know. and doing that. You could, actually. That'd you be totally so cool. Could. Like, the world's biggest solar eclipse I know, display. right? Anyways, our free solar eclipse classes. <laughs> oh, wasp. Oh, yeah. It's that time of year. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. It's tricky. Well, I will show this off. I went to Aldi today, and I had to get this for Pepper because it was on clearance for $4.99. And let me just say, oh, Trixie likes it, that it is such great quality. Let's see if she gets in. Come here, Trixie. Get in, Pep. Go over there, Trixie. Come here. Oh, <laughs> and Pepper. Pepper's coming. Look, come on, Pep. Pepper. Trixie wants to play with the I know, Trixie wants to play. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> Where's she at, Trixie? Is she in there? Trixie. <laughs> I so bad want her. Oh, I wanted her to poke her head out of the top, but she won't do it. Pepper. Look. Pepper. There she goes. Oh my God, get a picture. <laughs> get a picture. Oh my gosh, that is hilarious. Oh, you missed it. <laughs> Pikachu is actually at the groomers. What do you think he's going to do? Oh, look, she's pushing it around. <laughs> get it, girl. Get her. Look, get her. <laughs> this photo is moments before disaster. Oh, my gosh. That is a great shot, Blake. That is so funny.
So yeah, Pikachu is at the groomers. So I did get some seeds yesterday, you guys. I'll have to show you in another video how my garden's doing, but I picked up some cabbage. I have red cabbage seeds, but not green. And I picked up some yellow squash. And I picked up spearmint and peppermint. Now I do know I'm going to put those in its own container because those two plants, whatever you want to call them, um, they'll take over any garden. And yeah, we don't want that. So, all right, Blake, are you ready to go to the park? Oh, oh the other thing at this park too is we play Pokemon mm -hmm. Go there. And also we find rocks, the painted rocks. Have you guys ever seen them before? And so, yeah, maybe we'll come across the painted rock. We made it to the park. We're just uh, catching them all right now. <laughs> Pokemon Go. All right, so our area, 317, and it's 204. It says that it's happening right now. So, Blake, get yeah. the, you got the box. You might be able to do it from there as long as you get it. See, I can't. I don't have the sun. I shoot. But, anyways, we should try to see. Um, oh, there you go. You got to move it around. How much of it? Does it look different or no? No. Oh. See, that's what I was wondering. I wonder if the hole makes a difference. I just take my finger. Oh, don't do that. I don't have <gasps> no extra stuff. <laughs> <laughs> anyways. All right, we're going to go for a walk, and I'll show you around this little park it's really cute they're still building it a lot more stuff to still put in here i know they're trying to put tennis courts um volleyball courts they got already got soccer fields obviously baseball fields playgrounds um basketball court and they have like a really nice walking path and i hope to find some rocks oh the rocks i was telling you about i only have a couple in my car but they're like this they're little painted rocks and when you find one, this one's really cute. It's got a butterfly on it. Usually on the back, it'll have a, a website or like a Facebook group. Like this one is Pretty Girl Rocks. And the way that you can tell is they'll mark the back and put like F for Facebook. And you go on there and you post a picture that you found it and where you found it. And then you can either one, keep it paint a new one and replace it or move it somewhere else. I've been collecting them and my plan is when we go back to Maryland this summer, um, I know that they got a walking path there. I'm going to put them all there and, you know, re replace them somewhere in another state. I think it'd be kind of cool. But yeah, that website, if you, or the Facebook group, if you go on there, I mean, people are posting from all states, so they make their way around. Anyways. It's beautiful outside. It is 78 degrees. So, are you ready to go get our walk on? Yes. Blake is so excited. <laughs> Alright guys. Hopefully we can uh, fill you in on the uh, turtle eclipse. Alright, so I got a question for those of you. To consider it your question of the day from me. Ooh. So, I don't know if anyone in, you know any of our subscribers bowl or whatnot but if you do what is your highest score mm. what's your favorite ball to roll with if you know you got your own balls and whatnot that you throw down the lane um i'm asking for personal opinions because i've been looking for a new one <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> blake's gonna buy a new one <laughs> i need a new one Ooh. all right we're going out we're going out we're going out everyone Go guys. Alright, try it out. See. 
any difference. You would not believe this. <laughs> it <laughs> no. looks the exact same. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, anyways, <laughs> let me see. I mean, it might be slightly small. It looks the same. <laughs> Ain't nothing changed. Nothing changed. Lord have mercy, what are we doing wrong? Maybe you won't notice it until like it gets like almost covered completely. Yeah, probably. Which we have another at least half hour before we see that. <laughs> another half hour. All right, well, we'll check back. So we're walking around the park and one thing we notice is the temperature is starting to drop. You can feel it. It feels nice and cool and it just kind of looks like it's getting darker. So Blake, I said, let's go back to the car. We're going to look in our solar eclipse box again, see if we see any difference. You will not believe this. Uh, it, it actually looks the smallest bit smaller, uh -huh. but kind of So we're strange. still like 20 minutes away. Still like 20 minutes away. Here. There you go. Actually, Blake. That does look a little different now. Yeah, it um, looks slightly smaller, doesn't it? Actually, Blake, this it's you can see it. There's a flat edge where it's starting to go halfway across it. Yeah. It's not perfectly circle anymore, so it is starting to work. So it's it's only at like I don't know. I Let's see say. if we can get the show up on the camera. Oh, there you go, guys. Look at it. See? Oh, see it. It's kind of bright. Yeah, there you go. Look at it. It's like slightly flat at the top right there. I know. See, it's starting. Yeah. It's happening. The end of the world. <laughs> the end of the world. The end of the world. Oh. <gasps> okay. So what time are we at? We are at 3.11. What time did I say? It's getting dark. Like you can definitely see a change. It's set, I think, 3.17. 317 is when we will have our max viewing. So, shall we take a look, Blake, and see what we're at? We're at. Yeah. It says 317 and it's 311. So, and it's starting to look very dim and dark, and the temperature is changing. You can feel that the temperature is definitely going, going down. And we're still enjoying a little bit of Pokemon Go, too. We've been partying it up at Pokemon Go. All right, let's take a look in our view box and see what we see. Okay, so I created another hole because I wanted to see, and I created a really, really tiny hole. Huge difference. The tinier the hole, the bigger the viewing, if that makes sense. Let me see if I can capture it now, but definitely half the sun is covered up. Maybe even more. I'll show you. Do y'all see Pikachu? <laughs> so, Blake thinks the solar eclipse was lame. Our little viewing box, I don't know. It wasn't, it was okay. I don't know if the glasses are better. I've always heard the glasses were a hoax, though. Like, not a hoax, but like a ripoff. I guess if I could have gotten them for free, that would have been different. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed our little solar eclipse video. I'm waiting on Ben to finish up his tennis and then we're gonna go home back to the grind it was nice having that week off oh so nice but you had a week off no well i did happen to make lunch pick up ben every day so i have beat my hands up i had a uh a fire ant look bite my knuckle oh yeah that was and yesterday swollen. oh my gosh it's so sore anyways yeah, we're going to go ahead and close today's video. Chew, you want to say bye? <laughs> he got his fur cut, guys. So, all right. That's going to do it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye. Oh. <gasps>